A PIER HAS DIVIDED ST. PETERSBURG. NOW SOME ARE CALLING FOR CITY OFFICIALS TO START THE ENTIRE PROCESS OF COMING UP WITH A NEW PIER ALL OVER AGAIN. OUR BILL LOGAN IS LIVE IN ST. PETE WITH THE LATEST ON THIS ONGOING DEBATE. BILL? AND uh, BRENDAN, IT LOOKS LIKE IT'S BACK TO THE DRAWING BOARD. PRETTY MUCH uh, THAT'S THE PROPOSAL. INSTEAD OF THE FOLKS HERE IN ST. PETERSBURG HAVING A TAKE IT OR LEAVE IT REFERENDUM ON THIS VERY CONTROVERSIAL LENS DESIGN FOR THE REPLACEMENT OF THE PIER, IT LOOKS AT THIS POINT LIKE THEY MAY HAVE MORE CHOICES which could mean less controversy. By the time council had convened on this Thursday, a new bold tactic was already being floated in what has already been a ponderously punted political football. What to do with the city's iconic peer property? We want unity in this community. We've got to get back to it. We are divisive, and we're going to have a long, hot summer of just divisive conversations that is gonna, that's knocking us off our timeline, that's knocking us off our budget, knocking us off the process. St. Pete Chamber of Commerce President Chris Steinacher amplified that group's desire to start the peer replacement process over. A plan put forth in a letter to the mayor and council yesterday with the controversial lens design as but one choice to replace the inverted pyramid that closed May 31st. We also say let's get back on the timeline and budget and process. Let, we want to know when we're going to build the next pier and what's it going to look like. After 125 years, lost the pier. As the meeting moved toward the discussion of pier plans, referendum wording, and even the possibility of educational tutorials on what the lens actually is, it became more clear that the city administrators were falling in step with the chamber and they're, hold on a second, let's do a better job of figuring this out first rationale. It has been the most divisive issue since the building of Tropicana Field. And I think people have still have a bad taste in their mouth from that. And I think we, we start the process over, define what it is we want within the same constraints, and move forward. So you welcome this concept. I do. I do. Now, this discussion of this proposal for the uh, new plan to go forward on the pier is just beginning, and at this point, it promises to be uh, filled with a lot of very colorful discussion. We're covering every aspect of it. My colleague Chris Strankman inside right now as this meeting is getting started back up for the evening session. We'll have complete coverage tonight at 11 and, of course, on ABCActionNews.com. We're live tonight in St. Pete. Bill Logan, ABC Action News.